everybody. My name is John Kenny, and I'm the Technology Manager for Keysight's Power and Energy Division. I'm here today to talk to you about the new E36100 family of power supplies. And what's really neat about them is they're quite small. As you can see, this is a typical power supply that we've had in the past. And this is our new power supply that's the smallest we've ever made. It sits tiny on your bench, but it's chock full of capabilities and features that you need. So I'm going to describe to you a little bit about those capabilities and give you an idea what you can look forward to with this product. And it's really one of our newest family members that offers capabilities that we never had before in a bench power supply. For example, it uses new OLED technology for the display. It has LAN and USB built in. And it's really, really easy to use. And that's important in a power supply that could damage your product very easily. So let's show you a little bit about what it can do. Okay. To start off with, I mentioned the OLED display. OLED is the latest technology. It's available in some smartphones and other things. It gives you great viewing angles, which are really important because quite often you put your power supply uh, far away on the side of your bench so you can have your scope or your spectrum analyzer in the center. And that allows you to keep an eye on what that power supply is doing so if the device is drawing too much current, you can shut things down in an orderly fashion. Uh, the OLED also has great contrast which means it's easy to read from far away, which is great benefit as well. So the OLED is only one of the many features. The other one I wanted to talk about that's a highlight for us, and a first in a bench power supply, is USB and LAN capability. That's been the, the most requested feature for our bench power supplies to make them easier to use in automated applications on the bench. And we've implemented a full-featured USB and LAN. It's LXI LAN with a full web browser. The USB is full ca capability. So you can control everything you want to control on your bench very quickly. Now let's get to the actual power supply itself. It's very low noise. It's a linear technology using a pre-regulator to get the small size. So as you can see, the size is very uh, small. And if you could hear how quiet it is, it's also very, very quiet, which is important for a bench product. You've got the ability to control the voltage and current. And you can see both the voltage and current measurements and the settings at the same time. On the older products, you couldn't do that. We didn't have the resolution on the display. It's also very easy to set up voltage and current very precisely. You can control how fast the knob changes the output. You can either have it change it quickly, or just by pressing the button, you can move the cursor to any digit you want, and you can get very fine control. So it allows you to adjust if you want to be precise or if you want to move fast. And that's true for both voltage and current at the same time. So you can toggle between voltage and current displays of setting and modulate the settings very quickly. So that's an important feature for fine tuning what you want to get out of the output. But that's also backed up by very good accuracy. We have some of the best accuracy specs of any power supply on the bench. Great current measurement. In fact, we've added on, for the first time an ultra low range current measurement to measure standby currents. Standby currents are really important for bench power supplies to measure uh, battery powered devices. Battery-powered devices often go into sleep mode and draw very low single-digit microamp currents. And we can measure those very accurately in this product. And we do that without creating any glitches on the output as it switches in and out. We don't oscillate any of those kind of problems that many other products have trying to measure low currents, if they even have the feature. And in this small size, it's a remarkable capability to include. So the other things I wanted to talk about here as well is it's got a very easy-to-use user interface. And the reason I say that is that the older products that use LED displays and vacuum fluorescent displays cannot display graphics or text very easily. But as you can see here, we can very easily show you full uh, text-based menus that are very easy to traverse and change your settings. So for example, you can go in and change your I.O. configuration. So here's your LAN configuration. You want to change the IP address. You can very quickly make some changes on it and see the full IP address. Some of the other power supplies we've seen that have LAN built in require you to do awkward things with the seven segment displays, which make it very difficult to know that you have it correct. So that's a real benefit for setting this thing up on the LAN, which can be complicated. USB, of course, is much simpler. You plug it in, the PC recognizes it, and it works. So it's, it's also very seamless in that respect. So in summary, we have a really great set of features here that allow you to use this product easily on your bench. It doesn't take up a lot of real estate on the bench. It's easy to read from far away. It's very precise. It's quiet. 
It's very easy to use, and it connects using modern I.O. that you want to have. So you can power forward with the E36100 family of products.